She caught the attention of celebrities like Oprah, the Kardashians, Katie Couric after she posted a video of her 2020 goals online. But that same year, the pandemic threw a wrench in those plans. Take a look. All right, goal one, make more money. <laughs> I was, you know, been unemployed since March. Travel more, <laughs> lose weight, <laughs> be more social. <laughs> Cry less, cry less, cry less. I've cried every single day of this whole pandemic. Um, oh, it was a joy, joy, the opposite. opposite. That, that, everything that was supposed to happen, the opposite. The opposite. <laughs> Joining us this morning before she takes the stage right here in San Diego, comedian Robin Shaw with the cutest laugh, <laughs> may I say. Thank you for having me. I feel like much smarter sitting at like a news table. Do you? I, mean, I feel that way sometimes when I sit here too. Yeah, it's like very... I feel like my IQ has just gone up like six points. You know. Just don't ask me anything of importance. Really? But I have all these questions for you. <laughs> oh no, no, no. <laughs> okay, what was it like for you? Let's talk about that goals list yeah. for, for those that have recognized it or not. What was that all about? Yeah, it was the middle of pandemic. I found my goals list that I wrote in 2019 for 2020. And everything that I wanted, the opposite happened, not just for me, but for the entire world. Um, but I posted it one night on TikTok and I woke up the next morning and the entire world saw it. Because uh, everybody related to everyone, it. Yeah. I mean, everyone, everyone was trying to Go into 2020, make more money. Everyone's yeah. lost their job or <laughs> couldn't work at a stay home. Everyone was trying to lose weight, be healthier. We're all stuck inside. No one could go to a gym or do anything. Um, it was just like a very dark video that made people laugh at a time we needed laughter. When you woke up and you saw that, what did you think? That everybody was liking it and into it? I was like, why did I not put on makeup? Because <laughs> I didn't think anyone would see great. it. Come I had my on. hair in a bun, like no makeup. If I had known that millions would have seen it. I oh, think. Come on, all of us look like that during the pandemic. I know. And look, and if I wore makeup and had my hair down, it may not have done as well. Exactly. I think. But you know, the uh, self-centered part of me would like. Did you did you did you reset the goals for every this year? year? Every I mean, year we make new goals. I make with my followers on Instagram. We okay. come up with goals together. So what are your goals this year then? Okay, this is important. Okay, what? Well. I need to ride on a fire truck. So if anyone in San Diego has pulled oh. to a fire truck, call me, I'm here for another 24 hours. San Diego Fire Department, <laughs> Cal Fire, call they me. watch. I know they watch, because okay. when I see them out, they're like, we watch every morning. I could just go for around, around the corner. corner. She just wants to get on your fire truck and go round and round, yes? Yeah, I do. Okay. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> Sorry, not appropriate for morning news. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, what else was your what else are your goals? Um, we have a lot of stuff. Co-host a talk show, get on a game show. A lot of stuff we've already crossed off. We I mean yeah. we did Guinness World Record, break a Guinness World Record. We um, we did a lot already. Yeah. So it's just a few things left. Fire trucks, the big one. Fire trucks, the big one. I have a feeling somebody <laughs> in San Diego will make that happen for you. So you're in San Diego. Why you're Why are you here in San Diego? I have a stand-up show yes. tomorrow night. My drop it's unfortunately sold out well good for me that it's sold out but if you're watching it's sold out but you can follow me on social media and hopefully catch me next time I'm here I love San Diego so much it's, what do you love about San Diego what do I well the weather yes we have good weather um my ex-boyfriend's here <laughs> well, do tell. Is he watching? <laughs> of course Wait, do you still talk to him? Yeah. Are you friends? Best friends. Really? Yeah, we dated for like five years and then we broke up two years ago. We stayed really close friends. Okay. Yeah. So he's here, so you get to say so hi. I get to see him okay. and hang out with him, which makes me happy. Okay. I also just, I love San Diego. It's such a happy, like, I'm a happy person. Yeah. And San Diego's like a happy vibe, a lot we of smiley are. people. Yeah. So I just, I fit in here well. Did you hear that? The way she's talking about us, we're smiley, happy people. Where's my Raul Martinez. Is Raul Martinez my co-anchor fit into that? Uh, you have a podcast too that I, I understand. I haven't I haven't heard it. I need to listen to this. Call waiting. Okay. It is such a fun show. Every so it's just me and a phone and my followers, the people call in. Every week we have a different topic and let's say it is about exes. Then people will call in and tell me about their exes. I'll give them advice or we'll just hear what's going on. It's always a different topic and I love talking to people. So it's always it's always fun. Is there anything you you don't do um yeah like math <laughs> <laughs> i love your laugh i can sit here all day just your laugh thank is you. making me laugh well thank you for coming no, by thank and you for having me next time give us give san diego more of a notice 
Like, I'm sure do. there's people that wanted to watch the show, and it's sold out, so you can't see I it I will today. definitely be okay. back, I promise. Please, please do. Robin, thank you for being here. All right, 919, we're going to take a short break. We'll be right back. We need a fire truck for Fire Robin, truck, please. please. Fire Call truck.